Hey, how's it going? I'm Josh from 91 Tech, and we're gonna keep this video short and to the point. We're gonna go over every single device supported by iOS 13 or iPad OS, if that's what you wanna call it. Now, Apple didn't actually mention this in the keynote, which wasn't a good sign, but we know from the iOS 13 beta one software page, which gives all the devices supported. So as you can see here, everything from the iPhone 6S and newer, including the iPhone SE, is gonna be supported with iOS 13. And then on the iPad side, anything from the iPad mini 4 and iPad Air 2 and newer is also going to be supported. So what is support being dropped for? If you have the iPod Touch 6th generation, you're fresh out of luck, although the iPod 7 is of course being supported. The iPad Mini 2 or 3 both will not get support. The first iPad Air does not have support. The iPhone 5S does not have support, and neither does the iPhone 6 or 6 Plus. So for some people this is going to be a little disappointing, but it's kind of what we all expected. I'd like to hear your thoughts on this in the comments down below. Do you have one of these devices? I think it's uh, pretty impressive that the 5S and iPad Air especially lasted as long as they did up to iOS 12, but it is a little disappointing the iPhone 6 got retired early in comparison. So anyway, that's it for this video. Really short. I did do a video explaining all of WWDC in one minute if you want to go see that. Link in the description. And with that all being said, I'm Josh from 91 Tech. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all next time.